Get ready to uncover 10 surprising origins of everyday objects. In this video, we will be delving into the surprising origins of 10 familiar discoveries that you'll never look at the same way again. From the funny accidental invention of popsicles to the unexpected transformation of cleaning putty into Play-Doh, these tales of creativity and ingenuity will leave you amazed. So buckle up and prepare to discover fascinating facts about items of everyday use. Are you glued to learning new things every day? Welcome to Tell Me More, the channel in which you will find crazy facts about anything that you can imagine. Stay tuned. Now let's dive into it. 10. Popsicles. Chilling mistake turns tasty treat. Oh boy, the funny story of popsicles is a tale that'll make you grin. Picture a scorching summer day in 1905 when an 11-year-old kid named Frank Epperson mixed up a cup of powdered soda and water. All was well until he got distracted by a wild adventure or just plain kid stuff, and he forgot about the whole thing, stick and all, on his porch. Now, here's where it gets seriously cool or cold, rather. The night was so frosty that the concoction froze solid around the stick. When Frank woke up the next morning, he found his cup of soda had transformed into a lickable delight. And guess what he called his accidental masterpiece? Epsicle, a witty blend of his last name, Epperson, and Icicle. After a few more years of experimentation and likely plenty of slurping, Frank patented his idea in 1923. From then on, the frozen tree took off, morphing into the popsicles we slurp on those blazing summer days. It's like a magical mishap turned into the ultimate refreshing dessert, and we've been grateful to young Frank's forgetfulness ever since. 9. Post-it notes. Failed glue leads to sticky success. You won't believe the twisty-turny tale behind those trusty post-it notes that grace our office spaces and fridges. Imagine a lab at 3M in the swinging 1960s. Dr. Spencer Silver was on a mission to create a mega-strong adhesive, something that would glue just about anything anywhere. But here's the curveball. His experiment ended up giving him a sticky substance that wasn't quite the heavy-duty adhesive he'd been aiming for. This stuff stuck to surfaces, sure, but it was so gentle that it could be pulled right off without leaving a mark. Now this might have sounded like a whoopsie moment, but in walks Arthur Fry, another 3 and smarty pants. Arthur had a habit of using bookmarks to keep his hymn book pages in check during choir practice. Only problem was, those bookmarks kept falling out, much to Arthur's chagrin. But then, that not-so-sticky adhesive of Dr. Silver's? Bingo! Arthur used it to create bookmarks that held his hem book pages in place, without leaving a trace of residue when removed. Lightning struck, or maybe a choir angel whispered in his ear, and he realized this could be more than just a clever workaround. This could be a whole new way of thinking about sticky stuff. Teaming up with Dr. Silver, they refined the idea, giving birth to the iconic post-it note in 1980. And there you have it, an adhesive accident turned into a paper revolution that now helps us jot down reminders, doodles, and grocery lists galore. 8. Potato Chips A Grumpy Chef's Revenge Hold on to your taste buds, because the crunchy legend of potato chips traces back to the sassiest of chefs. Cast your mind back to 1853 in Saratoga Springs, where culinary maestro George Crumb was cooking up a storm at Moon's Lake House. One day, a finicky diner ordered a plate of fried potatoes, only to complain that they were way too thick and soggy for his liking. Now this was the moment that could have made any chef blow their top, but not George. In a fit of culinary defiance, George took those pesky potatoes, sliced them as thin as whispers, fried them till they were crispy like fall leaves, and then sprinkled them with salt as bold as a snowstorm. He plunked the plate in front of the finicky customer, probably with a smirk, and guess what? The diner devoured them with delight. The Saratoga Crunch Chips, as George aptly named them, were a hit. And just like that, the first ever potato chip, born out of sheer sassy creativity, became a snack sensation that took the world by storm. Crunch on, my friends. 7. Corn Flakes Accidental Crunch in the Morning Bowl Hold on to your breakfast bowls, because the story behind those golden crispy corn flakes involves a bit of accidental magic. Back in the late 1800s, you've got the Kellogg brothers, 
John Harvey and Will, running the Battle Creek Sanitarium, a wellness haven in Michigan. Now they weren't just serving up wellness, they were dishing out experiments too. They were experimenting with ways to prepare grains to make them healthier for their patients. One morning in 1894, a batch of boiled wheat was left out to cool, but oh snap, they forgot about it, and it went all stale overnight. These weren't your usual guys to cry over stale wheat though. They toasted it up, rolled it flat, and what do you know? Those flakes turned out crispy and utterly delicious. Light bulb moment. Why not serve these up as a breakfast option? And just like that, a simple accident gave birth to the cornflake, marching into our bowls and transforming our morning routines. 6. Silly Putty From War Effort to Playtime Wonder Get ready for a tale that's the very definition of unexpected twists and turns, the rise of Silly Putty. And guess where this all began? World War II. Now, during the war, there was a big hunt for alternatives to rubber because, you know, it was kind of hard to come by due to, well, the war. Engineer James Wright gets into the game, combining boric acid with silicone oil. And what does he get? Not exactly the rubber replacement they were hoping for. The result was a gooey, stretchy concoction that didn't quite meet the wartime demands. But hold on, don't count out this nutty putty just yet. Fast forward to 1950, and a clever marketer decides to give it a whirl as a toy. And what a decision that turned out to be. Kids wet bananas for it, stretching it, bouncing it, even copying newspaper print with it. Suddenly, that wartime rubber substitute that didn't quite hit the mark ended up becoming a timeless playtime favorite. The moral of the story. Sometimes the most unexpected twists create the most delightful surprises. Before we move further with the countdown of the 10 surprising origins of everyday objects, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up. 5. Coca-Cola A medicinal elixir turned refreshing beverage. Let's transport ourselves back to the wild, wild 1800s, where a pharmacist named John Pemberton was brewing up some magic. He mixed coca leaves and cola nuts with some other secret ingredients, and tada, he believed he'd created a miracle tonic. This concoction, initially dubbed Pemberton's French wine coca, was supposed to cure all kinds of ailments, from headaches to exhaustion. But then, oops, prohibition laws rolled in, and poof, out goes the alcohol in the formula. But guess what stayed? The refreshing taste. The revamped formula, sans booze, emerged as Coca-Cola, and it quickly caught the public's attention for its energizing qualities. Although it didn't quite end up curing everything under the sun, it surely got folks buzzing with its fizzy, delightful taste. What started as a medicinal experiment turned into a global phenomenon, leaving us forever grateful for John Pemberton's magical mix. 4. Microwave Ovens Accidental melted candy leads to culinary revolution. Hold on to your kitchen mitts, because the journey of the microwave oven starts with an accidental melted candy. Zoom back to 1945, World War II is in full swing, and engineer Percy Spencer is working on radar systems. Think magnetrons generating microwaves, when suddenly, he discovers a candy bar in his pocket has melted. Imagine the aha moment he must have had. Intrigued by this candy catastrophe, he decides to test things out with popcorn kernels. And what do you know? Those kernels pop like fireworks on the 4th of July. Seeing the potential, Percy takes the next step and files a patent for the microwave cooking process in 1947. That's right, from melted candy to popping popcorn, he paved the way for the culinary revolution we now know as the microwave oven. Suddenly, reheating leftovers, thawing frozen goodies, and zapping instant popcorn became a matter of minutes, not hours. Talk about a sweet accident turning into a kitchen game changer. 3. Teflon Slippery start in a laboratory. Hold on to your spatulas, because the story of Teflon's slippery journey is as fascinating as it gets. Picture 1938 and meet Roy Plunkett, a chemist at DuPont, on a mission to create a new refrigerant. Now Roy's got a lab, some chemicals, and high hopes. Only things don't go exactly as planned. One day, he discovers that the gas he's working with has transformed into a waxy white solid. 
you could say that wasn't quite the expected outcome. But hey, sometimes science surprises even its own creators. This solid, which would later be named polytetrafluoroethylene, PTFE or Teflon, has some unique properties. It's got the non-stick mojo, can withstand high temperatures, and even laughs in the face of chemical corrosion. Although it was a bit of a hum moment for Roy, it didn't take long for folks to realize the potential. Teflon quickly found its home in various industries, but it's in our kitchens where it truly shines. Pots and pans sliding like skaters on ice, eggs sizzling without a sticky aftermath, all thanks to a somewhat waxy accident in the laboratory. 2. Velcro nature's inspiration for secure fastening. Now get ready for a story that'll make you appreciate the wonders of nature and the genius of human observation. Imagine Switzerland, 1941. George de Mestrel, an engineer, is returning from a hunting trip with his furry companion, and they're both covered in burrs. These pesky things have a knack for sticking to clothes and fur, and George can't help but wonder why. So he whips out a microscope to solve the mystery. And what does he find? A world of tiny hooks on these burrs that latch onto loops in fabric or hair. Ding, ding, ding. A light bulb moment of epic proportions. George sees nature's fastening mechanism in action, and he's determined to recreate it. After years of tinkering, testing, and perfecting, he introduces Velcro to the world. The name itself is a genius combo of velours, French for velvet, and crochet, French for hook. Suddenly, shoes are easier to put on, bags close securely, and the possibilities are endless. What a revelation that something as simple as a burr could inspire such a revolutionary fastening solution. 1. Play-Doh Shifting from wallpaper cleaner to playtime favorite. Ready for a story that takes rebranding to a whole new level? Imagine the 1930s where you've got a company called Kutel Products, producing a putty-like substance. And guess what they were originally making it for? Cleaning wallpaper. Yeah, you heard that right. With the rising trend of vinyl wallpaper, their cleaning putty started feeling more like a relic than a necessity. Sales were plummeting, and it looked like the end of the road. But then, in walks Kay Zufall, an ingenious school teacher. She's trying to get her students to engage with art projects, and lo and behold, she notices they're using this very putty to shape and mold. It's as if the universe whispered in her ear. This putty's meant for play, not walls. Kudel Products gets the memo and decides to pivot, rebranding their product as Play-Doh in the mid-1950s. It's a lesson in innovation. Sometimes what you start with might not be where you end up. From a failed attempt at cleaning walls to a playtime powerhouse that's molded, pun intended generations of creative minds, Play-Doh's journey is a testament to the unexpected paths that innovation can take. That's all. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Did you know about these 10 surprising origins of everyday objects? Tell us in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give the video a thumbs up, and turn on post notification so that you do not miss the upcoming videos. See you in the next one.